Sector is clear. Give us everything we got! I'm All wings! Welcome back to Ant Lives The Channel. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell if you are new to the channel. As I always say, I got your back to the channel gang. You guys already know I got your back. And to the new subscribers, you're going to come to find out that I got your back. This right here marks my 296th build for NBA 2K22 current gen. I am the old head goat builder. I am the best builder in the world. And I am the hardest working builder for NBA 2K22 current gen in 296 builds. Only prove that fact. This right here is an epic first groundbreaking moment right here for the NBA 2K community. It is a comp build. It is LeBron James's exact pass first wing build with Hall of Fame shooting and Hall of Fame playmaking badges. And you're only going to find this build here at Ant Lives the channel. Now let's get into this build. Now we're going to go with the playmaking, the shooting, and then the one eighth defensive and finishing skill breakdown pie chart. Now I'm going to go right here with the third. Um, physical profile and we do not have the 10 we do not have the 10 we do not I was surprised I tried but we do not have the 10 and I'm cool with that now we're going to bring his close shot up to 83 nothing on his driving layup we're going to go all the way up on his driving dunk and we're going to go all the way up on his standing dunk and then we're going to go all the way up on his post hook nothing on his mid range but we're going to bring his three pointer to 80 all right, nothing on this free throw. But we're going to bring his post fade all the way to 83. Now, I have a fadeaway tutorial, and it's called Fadeaway Tutorial. Learn how to shoot fadeaways like Michael Jordan and Kobe Bryant, where I show you how to shoot the fadeaway jump shot anywhere inside of the three-point line. You're going to be able to hit that shot off of the dribble, and especially with this build right here. Now, that's a total of 18 badges. We're going to go all the way up on his play, play, uh, pass accuracy. We're going to go all the way up on his ball handle. So he has 20 playmaking badges. Nothing on his post control. We're going to go all the way up on his interior. Now we're going to bring his perimeter defense to 72. We're going to go all the way up on his lateral quickness to 73. Now he's still, we're only going to bring the 54. All right, 54. Now we're going to bring his block all the way up. And then we're going to finish the rest out on his defensive rebound now that's a total of four defensive badges and this build will have 42 total badges all right now i'm going to go with burley and there's a reason why i'm going to go with burley you can't go with slight but i'm going to go with burley now you'll see why and you'll understand why now we're going to keep him at six uh seven now for his weight you can go all the way down to 208 pounds all the way to 265 and get exact shades of LeBron James okay now we're going to bring his wingspan all the way out we bring it back one you, you don't gain anything on this three-pointer you just gain up one on your post fade and at 81 is good and then you lose on your close shot and your standing dunk so 89.0 is the best wingspan for the bill now whenever you ignite the playmaker takeover you're going to get a five of your physicals a five of your finishing a five of your shooting a 10 year playmaking and a five year defensive rebound. Now, I know a lot of you say, Man, you should have taken the shot take. I'm, I'm taking the shot take. That's great if that's what you want to do. But this is LeBron James, and I want to play to his characteristics of being a strong playmaker. So, we're gonna, I'm going to take that playmaker uh, takeover because it's going to give him a 10 to his ball handle. So, when he's at 99 of wall, he's going to be ready to go. Now, it's like I said before, now when you're 90, like I said, when you're 99 at 99 overall, that's when this build is really going to stand out for you. Not not even being the fact that you can shoot, but at 99 overall, you're going to have a close shot of 90. And when you're not decides to take over, that's going to be a 95. I mean, not decides to take over the playmaker take over. That's going to be a 95. You're going to have a driving dunk of 71 and 99 overall. And when you're not the playmaker take over, that would be a 76. Now, you're going to have a standing dunk of 79 and 99 overall. And when you like to play make a takeover, that's going to be a 84 as well as your post hook. Because that's going to be a 79. And when you like to play make a takeover, 
take over, that will be a 84. You're going to have a three-point shot because you're going to have a three-pointer of 81. And when you ignite the playmaker take over, that's going to be an 86. Now, your post fade will be at 85 and 99 overall. Go watch that uh, fadeaway tutorial. Learn how to shoot fadeaways like Michael Jordan and Kobe Bryant. And when your night to put a uh, playmaker takeover, that's going to be a 90. So that's going to be a decent um, option for him off of the dribble. Like I said, go check that fadeaway tutorial out, guys. Y'all going to love this build here. He's he's a demigod. This is the number one cop, cop build right now for small forward, being the fact that it's LeBron James. Now, um, you're going to have a pass accuracy of 89 and 99 overall. And when you ignite the playmaker takeover, that's going to be a 99. As well, your ball handle will be a 79. And when you ignite the playmaker takeover, that is great for this build because of its speed. And you're going to be able to speed boost. But you're going to have a ball handle of 89. <clears throat> yeah, I would rather have you have a ball handle of 89 than a ball handle of 84. Now, your post control will be a 47 and 99 overall. And when you ignite the playmaker takeover, that would be a 57. You're going to be able to defend in the paint because you're going to have a 60 interior defense and 99 overall. And when you ignite the playmaker takeover, that's going to be a 65. And then you're going to have a perimeter defense of 77. And when you ignite the um, playmaker takeover, that's going to be an 82. I mean, a 76. And that would be an 81. And then you're going to have a lot of quickness of 77 and, and uh, 99 overall. And when you ignite the playmaker takeover, that's going to be an 82. Then you're gonna have a steal. That's great because that's a good steal. 55 is good on this game, but you're gonna have a steal of 69. I mean, a 59 and 99 overall. And when you ignite the playmaker takeover, that's gonna be a 64, as well as your block because your block's gonna be a 69 and 99 overall. And when you ignite the playmaker takeover, that's gonna be a 74. And then you're gonna have a rebound of 77 and 99 overall. And when you ignite the playmaker takeover, that is gonna be a what is that? 77, 82. Now, on to your physicals and what the playmaker will do for you because this is going to give you a 13-point 13 13 jump, being the fact that you have the playmaker take over, and then you get the added bonus of having a 10 to your ball handle. But there's four ways to get the fours, and not just Gatorade facility, reaching level 40, winning the NBA championship, and getting the 99 overall. Now, you're going to have a speed of... 85 and 99 overall and an acceleration of 84 and when you ignite the playmaker takeover you're going to get a plus five of those as well so that's going to be a a speed a speed of what 90 and then an acceleration of 89 now your vertical that will be a 62 with 99 overall and when you ignite the playmaker takeover that's going to be a 67 now this is a great thing about this build right here that i like which what kind of evens it out for me because your strength is key for this build. But you're going to have a strength of 65 and 99 overall. And when you ignite the playmaker takeover, that's going to be a 70. So that's excellent for a small forward to have a 70 strength going through the hole. So I like it. I like this build a lot. And being the fact it's going to be able to shoot off the dribble. Man. Woo, round of applause, baby. Groundbreaking moment. Now, like I said, I'm going to take the, play, the playmaker takeover for sure. And there you have it. Only at Ant Lives, the channel where history is made. This is LeBron James's first ever pass first wing exact build with Hall of Fame shooting and Hall of Fame playmaking badges. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell if you are new to the channel. Because I always tell you guys, and I ain't told y'all in a long time, you do not want to miss out on my daily builds. Now, what I'm going to do is test this build. And what I mean by that, I'm just going to show you guys why I placed the badges if I was to use this build. Whew, first ever. Now, we're going to go up. All right, now we got five. And what I'm going to do, being the fact that I know that this build is fast and it's going to beat a lot of people off the dribble, I'm going to take, if it was slower, I would go with gold. I would go with gold, unstrippable. But being the fact that it's faster, I know the bill's going to be able to beat a lot of people off the break, off the dribble alone, and be able to take off with limitless takeoff. I'm going to take that limitless takeoff as on gold. All right, because I want him to jump from a distance as much as possible. Now we got 13 shooting badges. I'm going to blind this Hall of Fame mismatch expert, stop and pop, and then hot zone hunter. All right, now I got 20 playmaking. We'll hyperdrive, of course. Quick first step. 
quick chain, triple threat juke, and downhill. Now, you wanted to really get, that's going to cause a lot of problems right there. If you want to go with that, that would be cool. I'm going to see what this does in build, my builder too. I like this build a lot. Alright. Now. I'm going to go with chase down. Rebound chaser. Let me see. Do I want chase down here and then rim protector? I'm not going to sweat uh, rim protector. All I'm going to look down, look for on defense is the chase down. I do have a high steal so I can play the passing lanes. But I'm going to look to get chase downs and grab rebounds to push the break, to set the break going because I do have a three off the dribble and I can, I'm fast enough and I do have a quick first step to get to the hole. Now, if that's what you're looking for, then you're going to have to have, make sure you got uh, downhill or Hall of Fame. And there you have it. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell if you are new to the channel. You already know your boy Ant Live is happy. <laughs> but there you have it. This is LeBron James's exact first ever pass first wing with Hall of Fame shooting and Hall of Fame playmaking badges. I am the old head gold builder. I am the best builder in the world. And I am the hardest working builder for NBA 2K22 current gen. And 296 builds only prove that fact. And without any further thing being said, I am...